Hello everyone, welcome to Tech Tuxedo. Hope you all had a good time. So today we will be speaking and we will discussing about log rotate command and I will tell you what it does, how it works, what are the config file and what is the syntax uh, for log rotate. So basically if you go to the log rotate main page it's very much it's very descriptive uh, log rotate is basically used to rotate compress and mail system logs like the command name says it you can define you have a, it, it has got its own syntax and you can define how to rotate your logs so to start with main log rotate config file lies in etc log rotate dot com that is the main log rotate file and it has got some global variables which is the first one is weekly that says to rotate logs on weekly basis then a rotate 4 where it shows it says how many weeks of log you want to keep so it's like for the 4 it means it's gonna take f it's gonna keep logs f from last 4 rotations and then it's gonna delete them so you can w you can actually uh, edit these and you can do it uh, you can say to log rotate daily if you want it to be done daily and you can even ch change the rotate value and if it's daily over here, it's it's it, it's it's gonna mean rotate four is gonna mean uh, how many daily copies, how many days of daily copies you're gonna keep. Then it's a create is to uh, actually create new log files after deleting the, deleting the old world one. Will it create a new log? So that for that you use create date extension is meaning it means if if the log is rotated, it's gonna have the date extension in the end and the compress it is to compress your logs and it's hashed by the way and then there is this syntax and this syntax means it's going to rotate this log it's going to do it monthly instead of weekly above and it's going to create a f new file with these permissions and this user id and the minimum size before log rotation has to be 1 mb and it's going to keep only one copy of the file and now there is this include variable as well which actually defines a directory which has got whole lot of parameters which log rotate use so log rotate is actually run once daily and it's run via, via default cron job and it's it's gonna run daily but if you want to manually run it you have to use log rotate you have to force it and you have to use log rotate hyphen f and then the file which is log rotate.conf and I'm not gonna run it now I'm gonna show you my var log directory I'm gonna show you okay this is how it looks and then I'm gonna run it and now I'm gonna show you yeah so basically you, s you see the difference it was like this earlier there were no log rotation there was no log rotated and it, it has all got the value 145 180 and now after they are rotated you can see a lot of zero files because the log got rotated and a lot of uncompressed files because of log log rotate config and I can even write my own my own log rotate con configuration in log rotate dot D I'm gonna do go there I'm gonna write my own custom now this custom is is rotating a log file in in temp directory it's called rotate file And then what it does it is, is it, it it runs daily. It keeps one day of old log, and it compresses the old log, and ultimately it creates a new log file. Now I'm gonna create this file. 
stamp rotate you can see it's there okay now I'm gonna run log rotate and there we go our log got rotated it, it is compressed because we gave this compressed parameter sorry okay because we gave this compressed parameter it's got it got compressed and it's gonna rotate daily and it's gonna keep one copy of the file and then it created a new one because we use the create parameter similarly you can even uh, run scripts in log rotate so I'm gonna run a script now okay after post rotate just to restart my restart my any service NTPD service okay and you will see and there we go so because the log rotate is defined to run once now when we run the custom file you will see that is actually actually restarted NTPD service as per our definition various things uh, uh, various more uh, variables to try in log rotate and for that I will suggest you to actually go to man log rotate to have a look at those there are many 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 options to go and try and this was just a basic video to show you how to rotate logs hope this was useful and we'll come back with another video soon thank you guys have a good day please like and subscribe to my channel if you find this video useful you can put in your comments your comments are really valuable thank you have a good day cheers